But it's the booty for me. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, um, today it's actually like it's later in the day, it's actually 5 20 um, right now. I'm coming out the house pretty late because, like, my little um, my, my friend she came into town today, and so I'm kind of like, um, I just wasn't feeling it. I was, I slept a lot today, I napped a lot, I was in my bed literally all day, um, and so right now. What I'm about to do is go to, um, I don't want to say the name wrong. I think I'm, I think I want to say TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx, I'm considering Target. I might have to go to Target too because I want to pick up a juicer. Um, and what else do I need to go to? I think they might be getting, oh no, I need to go to Five Below. So I'm debating, I don't know if I want to go to Five and Below first because I'm actually going there to get a tripod for my phone so that I can be able to hold um, my phone and record with that. Um, so I'm debating, it's so, I don't, I'm trying not to show y'all my, um, my black or whatever, but yeah, so I have to do that. So I'm debating if I want to go to Five and Below first because I feel like Five and Below is, is it takes me out of my way. So I have to go like I'm, I would be going forward and then going back and then coming forward again. I mean, I guess it really don't matter though. But nevertheless, that's what we're doing today. Um, so I'm gonna take you guys along with me. Um, I'll show you guys everything that I get. Um, and yeah, we're gonna pick up some items. I needed to really like um, re up on all of my like body care stuff. So like um perfumes and stuff i'm good on i still have some of my favorites that i like to use um i need to get like soap um tooth i'm almost out of toothpaste um i'm down to one toothbrush left i usually like when i go i'll get like the multi-packs so that way um i like have them and then if i have company over or something like that they'll be able to have a toothbrush to use um and what else i want to get some rags i need to get a new towel um I'm thinking about getting a new um, comforter and sheet set. I love getting a new comforter and sheet, so I'm definitely going to do that. Um, and what else did I need to get? I think that's it. So I'm going to take you guys along with me. Whatever we get, I'm going to show you guys everything, let you guys know how much everything costs. And just, yeah, we're just going to go and do this little trip together. So um, if you are new, make sure that you are subscribed, girl, okay? I'm going to be showing you guys everything as much as I possibly can. I'm going to be consistent with vlogging. That is like one of my things that I'm so serious about with 2021. Like, it's a lot of stuff that I've already been changing. Um, today is the 24th. Um, more than likely, I'll put like the um, the date on the screen so that you guys will know like what's today or whatever. But um, yeah, like I, I, I got some stuff to tell you. I got some tea. 
So I'm going to um yeah, I'm I'm going we're going we're going to talk. We're going to talk, girl. We're going to talk. So once I get back in the house, um I'm going to show you guys everything. We're going to talk a little bit, have a little girl chat, um life update pretty much and um yeah, so stay tuned. because the music was so motherfucking loud like is we having a concert or is we here shopping like what's the so anyway so i couldn't record in here like i said um but where do i get out of here baby hold up now okay let me go this way i think you can go out this way anyway so i got the stuff that I needed. I'm actually about to try out one of the things right now. So let me actually repark with my hot booty ass. And uh, I was so hyped to leave. So I'm going to TJ Maxx. That's where I really want to go. But let me pull over real quick so I can um, try to see if... I had got a, a tripod for my car. Um, so I'm going to try to see if that's going to work. Hopefully y'all can see me. I'm going to try to brighten this up when I edit. Um, so that, you know, y'all be able to see me. But yeah one of the things i got i'm gonna show you the rest of the stuff i got but one of the things i got was um a tripod i got one that i can hold and then i got one um that actually mounts onto the car i actually got three i have a wall mount that's number one i have a handheld tripod which i'm going to try to use in tg max excuse me and then i have um a car mount tripod so we're going to try to car mount tripod right now okay so right now i have you guys on the car tripod it's so it's dark in my car my lights it's like a, a fuse blue or whatever so my lights and my car don't work so let's get a just get a but nevertheless um we're back in motherfucking action um i'm not going to use this a whole lot i think that i'm only probably going to use this when i'm um like able to sit it's a little flimsy and so what i'm actually going to wind up doing is going to best buy and getting something that's a little bit more high quality like this was just something quick to grab um just so that i can have like different uh utensils and stuff that i can use to be able to record with so um eventually i'm going to go to best buy i'm still deciding if this is going to be a um a weekly vlog I think that I want to do weekly vlogs because, like, with my schedule, I want to be honest with myself. And with this year, I want to really get into doing my channel and, like, um, you know, like, just interacting with you guys more, building more of a bigger platform with you guys, um, and just being more personal and having a better relationship. Child, I wish they could stay right there with their light. But anyway, so um, I am like i was saying i'm going to go to best buy to get something better um but i don't know if i'm going to do that in this vlog or if i'm going to do that in the next vlog i think for this week i'm probably going to do more of a daily vlog we'll see though we'll see once i go through this footage or whatever from what i'm going to record for tonight um that'll make me decide whether or not i'm going to do a weekly or a daily thing um it just depends i want to be able to give you guys like a nice length of a vlog um give you something to actually watch that's entertaining um and i want it to be like more of a quality over quantity so that's like one of my goals for this year so right now um we are about to go to tj maxx and get like all the other little stuff that i needed or whatever and um yeah i'm gonna take you guys along with me um to do that and then i'm not sure what i'm doing up today I, I don't know if i'm gonna take you guys home like i don't i don't know i don't know we're gonna figure it out though okay we looking real cute 
lip gloss is popping okay face is popping everything is popping she's cute so yeah we're gonna go tj max and hopefully i'll be able to record in there i don't remember whether or not tj max plays music but i don't think that they do but we'll see so i just made it to um tj max um i have you guys on my uh on my tripod right now which I'm a little skeptical about because I have like this case on that's like really soft or whatever. And so like once I, when I put it on there, it was fine, but it like did slide off, like not right away, but it slid off eventually or whatever. So I'm a little skeptical about that, but nevertheless, we've made it to TJ Maxx and um, I'm about to go in here right now, duh. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna test this out. Um, I am so like self-conscious unintentionally um, when it comes to like just people staring. Like it was just a man that was just walking by in front of my car. And it's like people know that people do YouTube. Like from my city, it's not a lot of people that I know that, that do YouTube. It's not, it's, I maybe know two people that's in, hmm, maybe four. I, I know of four people that's in Philly that um, actually has a YouTube and that does YouTube or whatever, but it's not really something that I know people to do here. So, nevertheless, people are always going to stare. When you're doing something that they're not doing, they're always going to stare. And so I kind of just try to keep that reminder to myself, like, and to not be self-conscious of what I'm doing because at the end of the day, it's not even their business. Um, but it's, it's still just a, it's a thing that's real, regardless of if people try to make it seem like it's not like that they owe their so they don't they're not phased or shit like that bitch girl I'm, I'm gonna try to bleep that out but yeah nevertheless it, we're going into tg mix right now i am just looking for like little stuff that i don't have um i definitely need like soap but i'm seeing like a lot of hand soap and stuff so that's the only thing not really a whole lot of like um body soap hmm. They have a lot of brands in here right now that I don't know about. Um, I'm not like opposed to trying like new stuff or anything like that, but they usually have like um, stuff that I know of in here, but today they really don't. So I'm kind of like, I don't know. Cause I still have to go to, um, to Target too because I want to see if they have a juicer, but right now, I don't know. TJ Maxx, their like, prices are better when it comes to um, things like, you know, cosmetics. Uh, this is cute. I love me a teddy.
they're like this the team. Thinking about getting a coffee cup. This is cute. Um, I kind of want to get something that has to do with like my bowl. Hmm. Hmm. I just left out of TJ Maxx. Um, I got what I needed for the most part. The only thing I couldn't really find. Oh, Lord. That's going to stress me out. This one. <laughs> I never noticed it because I don't even look right there. But, um, yes, yeah, so I got everything that I needed to get. And for the most part, I got everything except for um, soap. So I have to go and get that um child I gotta go get that from Target um uh, which I wasn't necessarily trying to do my main reason for coming to TJ Maxx was to get um like soap and lotion and stuff like that because their prices are a lot better but I wound up getting like um some candles which I'm actually glad about because I did need that so I got like my candles my rags and my towel and stuff like that um so yeah so now we're just gonna head to um target so i can get like my body wash and stuff and i also wanted to see if target had any um juicing machines uh because i wanted to try to avoid ordering one i've been trying to get one for so long um but it's just the whole ordering thing i'm one of them type of people like that i'm not really that fond of of, of ordering stuff because i just like it's i don't know it's just nerve-wracking i like to see stuff before i um before i purchase so um we're gonna we're on the way to target right now um i love tj mix like they had a lot of good stuff in there um but this time around they didn't really have um some of the brands that i'm used to and like when it comes to like cosmetics and putting things on my body i like to stick with things that i know um that work and so they didn't really have a lot of stuff that i knew of um so i didn't um get anything like that i did actually wind up getting something that i'm really um actually happy about and i'm going to show you guys once i get home um it's, it was actually pretty interesting and this will be my first time getting something that's like this so um i'm going to definitely show you guys that um but yeah so we're on our way to target now like i said before and i'm going to try to record in there i did record a little in tj Maxx, obviously because you guys will see that before you even see this part but um they play music in there too and at this point i'm about to get a petition and i'm gonna get some some other youtubers to sign that shit because like y'all like i'm not getting copyrighted because y'all want to play this corny ass song in the background of my stuff but what i'm gonna look into though a little bit when i get home before i edit um it's just about like kind of doing like an overlapping sound on the video um because i know i have seen a few youtubers do that but i want to know how effective it is before i actually go ahead and upload because it's annoying to edit and do things like that and then for you to get a um for you to get like a copyright um notification it's, it's really annoying 
um so after you done picked like the perfect sounds and stuff like that um but yeah so i'm going to focus on the road so there's no accidents or anything like that and i am going to talk to you guys once we get the target That's so fucking crazy. I was thinking about trying one of these. But I just y'all, I, I don't I don't understand the taking it out part. Like that's my only thing with using that. Um I feel like it'll be good for me with how my flow is. But I just this is the original one that I actually heard of. The other ones are um I think a little bit newer. I think they're newer, I'm not sure. Um, but this is the one that I hear people talk about the most. This, I've heard of the Cora Cup and then Flex. But I'm debating, like, I don't... I, oh, but I see Cora has organic tampons. I might try them out. I've been wanting to try the organic tampon. Um, hmm. But I, I do... I love the ones that I use now which is um I do use you by Kotex um I'm not sure and then I do like I like Tampax Radiant those are really good too uh but we'll see I'm trying not to get copywritten so copyrighted I, oh, I don't know why I always say copywritten like where the fuck did I get that from where did I get that from but I'm not trying to get copyrighted so I'm gonna take all the stuff I need then we're gonna get up out of here But I think this one was only maybe like sixty dollars at the most. No, I'm not. It was like sixty dollars. The other ones was like a hundred dollars, one twenty. So and this one came with a warranty too. So if it breaks, um, I could just go to the company and get another one. Uh, but it comes with like this little cleaning tool. I think 
the part where the juice goes or where the pulp goes. I'm not sure, but we about to figure it out. Yes, I wanted to get this juicer because right now I'm doing like smoothies and stuff. But um, I just feel like some fruit do doesn't go well in smoothies. Like you have to juice it first and then you can put it inside of your smoothie. Like um, apples. So that's what I'm going to actually be juicing today. Well, tonight. Um, to see how well this works. I feel like that's like the the um the fruit that you have to try on all of them because a lot of them say that they can fit like an apple into like this part right here in the top, but they be lying and so we finna see. Let me actually bring you guys. So this is what it looks like. It's really foamy at the top. Um, but yeah, this is apple juice. So it, it definitely works. It's a lot louder than what I thought it was gonna be, but yeah, so 
Yeah, this is all this is like the pulp and stuff. This is what the inside looks like. And then I didn't juice a whole lot of stuff, so that's why I think it's kind of just like resting at the top right here. But yeah, I like it a lot. This is so decent. And it's it's fast too. Okay, yep, so it looks like the juice is starting to kind of like uh settle so it looks a lot clearer now. So I am back home in my room. Um, so I just got finished showing you guys like the juicer um, that I got. Um, and comment down below if you juice, um, if you have any recommendations for like products or anything like that, um, or just like some good fruits and vegetables that I can juice. Um, I pretty much can eat anything um i am allergic to apples but i can have apple juice or um applesauce i just can't have like the actual skin that's on the apple um and i'm allergic to bananas too um but i can eat the banana the inside but the pulp it, um it kind of messes with me so i'm gonna show you guys the things i got from tj maxx target and five below so i draw in tj maxx this is <laughs> the bag of stuff that I got. Um, I below. I started using everything that I had in there already. Um, I didn't show you guys the milk that I have in my car, but I'll probably show you guys that another time. It's something basic. Um, or not for sure, just to show you guys right here. So, this is the car mount that I got. Um, it's it's okay. It ain't nothing special at all, honestly. And then the tripod that you guys are on right now, which is like a smaller um, version. Like, I do have my ring light, so I use that. And then I have um, like a taller tripod that you can kind of like change the level of it. And um, it fits my iPad as well. I, I have that. Um, it's okay. Um, I, this one I got, this is the one. So if you guys go there if you want to try it out. Um... I like this a lot. Um, I actually, you know, this I just got it. But I used this when I was in Target and TJ Maxx. And um, it holds, the, it, hold, it held my phone pretty well. Um, and I had like a case on my phone, so that was a plus too. Um, and I just like the fact that it has like a, it has like a, a um, imprint of like a hand. And so you can hold, it, it kind of like fits your hand basically. And then you can open up the two legs on the side, which are the ones that's right here these two legs on the side you can actually open them up and then um sit your device wherever you want to sit it at and you can kind of like um move them like in and out like this and it they can it can fit into like a tighter space um i'm not mistaken this fits cameras as well um the part that the phone actually sits on you can twist it um so it can fit your camera um what else I think that's I think that's pretty much it. Um, oh, and it rotates. The head rotates back and forth. Um, so I like it a lot. Um, of course, the head comes from probably the love. And then I got um, I just got a charger for my car, one that can like actually stay in my car. Um, and then from TJ Maxx, I went a little bit crazy and got a lot of candles. So oh yeah, no, this is from Five Below too. So this is for a wall mail. So I was thinking about using this. Um, I'm debating because so this is, it has adhesive on here. So um, I, I'm assuming that once you put it on um, the wall, you it was it's supposed to stay there or whatever. So um, yeah, I'm debating if I want to put this in my bathroom or if I want to put this in my bedroom. I'm not too sure i and then i was saying about the kitchen too because i wanted to start doing like uh cooking vlogs but the only thing is like sometimes i be needing like different angles when it comes to cooking so i don't i'm not sure about that um i don't know i gotta i'm, I'm gonna think about this one i may just have to get more than one uh, but i do like the idea of this a lot i think it's really smart and it fits your tablet as well so um it's like a it's a win-win so um yeah so that's the last thing i had got from problem below so from TJ Maxx, I got um, I got like some mascara because I was running out. Um, I got this is one of the candles I got. So I don't know if you guys have ever been here, but they wrap the candles up for you. So this one is um, apple honey and butter. 
baby <laughs> this is very grown you can sm it, it, it kind of has like that fall smell but not too festive like i don't mind festive um candles or anything like that but um yeah it's just not it's not too festive i like it a lot um it has that that hint of half of apple but it, it's kind of like um it's a little bit grown like i don't know i, I like it a lot so, um, I usually do go for their candles. Their candles smell really good. These are, I'm not sure if that's LW. I believe it's LW um, Home. But this is what it looks like up close. So, you guys can um, Google it and try to find it or go to your local TJ Maxx. They usually have a lot of these. And then I like the color of it, too. It's very just grown looking and cute. So, I, I don't know. Like, for some reason, I've been, like, really attracted to this color like i'm gonna show you guys um what else i got and you'll see like okay like i see what you're talking about but this like deep cranberry color like this i don't know what it is i just been really feeling this a lot lately so i um, picked up this um i have um this one oh this one was called lava this i liked a lot um it caught me off guard. I, I, I'm i surprised about the name, I'll say. Um, this smell is, is sweet. Um, I feel like it'll do really good in my room. Um, I think like certain smells um, can do good in like a smaller space. And then this is a smaller candle. Um, but I like this one a lot. Is this, I know this is by a different company. Um, but... It's called lava. It's white, um, but it's just it's pretty. It's a pretty smell. It's a soft smell. Um, not fruity, but it kind of almost gets you to fruity, but it's not quite there. Um, let's see. Oh, I got this too. This is my first time getting something like this. Um, this is a, a a rum mist. So this is what it looks like. Very pretty. I like the style of it, so it'll go good in my room. Um, and so yeah, so it's a luxury rum mist. Um, I guess you could spray it on like your bed, your, your um, curtains and stuff like that. Whatever you want to spray it on, or just spray it in the air. Um, okay, yeah, that's that's exactly what it says. Spray into the air or your interior. So let me actually spray this. So I can kind of describe it to you guys. So this is like, it's not super strong. It kind of it's it's not. So I, I think I would per start to get these. So I would prefer this over like, uh, um, over like a Febreze. It's very subtle and it kind it's, it's almost like perfume for your room. Um, it's really it's pretty. Like it's nice. Like I feel like if I was a person that like if I spray this and then walked into it and then I walked into a room, um, I would like this a lot. This is yeah, I like this a lot. Honestly, I really do. Um, they had like other ones. Um, they said that this one has white cedar, peppercorn, um, yeah, black currant. So it's yeah, it smells really good. I wish you guys could actually smell it, um, but I like this a lot. So I would definitely recommend a rum mist. Um, it's not nearly as strong as like a um, an air freshener. So that's why I, I, I think I'm gonna stick with those over like a Febreze. I don't really even use Febreze anyway, but. Um, then I got this one. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. And that's the thing too about TJ Maxx. Like, don't don't sleep on TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx be having um, like if you are a candle lover, if you're a cosmetics and like you know like skincare and stuff like that. Like, if you're into all that type of stuff, you definitely want to try out TJ Maxx before you go to like a um a more name brand store like um Target and stuff like that because they they have a lot of stuff that is in Target like stuff that everybody would use um. I guess the company just, it might have been like maybe one little thing that was off or it might have not sold at a particular store. And so then they sell it at stores like TJ Maxx and Rawls and things like that. Um, so this next candle is called Lavender Sage. Um, it's, it's sweet, herbal, and calming. That's how they describe it on here. Um, it's definitely warm. It says that it has like a woodland moss um, smell to it and a chamomile smell. Um, I never smelled, I never burnt sage. I'm not into that at all. Um, so 
I've never smelled sage before, but this smells really good. Um, I think that what I'm definitely smelling is like that wood smell and um, lavender can be kind of strong and this is not overpowering. So if you like lavender, but you want it, you want it like a more of a calmer smell, this would be good for you. This one is from, this one's called DW Home. Ooh. DW Home. I love the color of it. Um, yeah, this is what it looks like. Really big. Like this is almost the size of my head um and this one let me see if it tell you how long it burns oh this one is this one burns for 90 hours that's that's great um the other ones be like 56 and stuff like that um let me see what other candles i got um the next one is called calming waves this one, I like this one a lot. It kind of reminded me of um, my grandma. It has like a um, like a soap smell to it, but yeah, like a lotion. It kind of smells like Dove. Yeah, it smells. It, that's so crazy. It didn't smell like that that strongly in the store, but yeah, this smells like Dove. It has a double wick in there, um, which I do love. Um, Fifty six hours of burning. Um, and yeah, this smells like soap. So I think this will go good in the bathroom. I think that's why I actually got this one was for my bathroom. One of these I got for my bathroom. I put, oh, I had a lemon one that I already put downstairs. Um, I didn't burn it yet. So I'll show you guys if I can remember to. Um, but I got that. I like that a lot. It's, um, I think it'll go good for downstairs. Um, and I think that might be it for the candle. So oh this is so this is what i wanted to show you guys that i was saying i was excited about um so this is a scrub it is coffee it's a coffee and a sugar scrub with coconut oil um oh child i'm, I'm trying to re read this on the thing but it says it right here with coconut oil it exfoliates um invigorates and um it hydrates so this is what it looks like it smells like coffee oh it's so decent oh my god like it's yo it smells like um like like sweet coffee and i think that's just the sugar and the coffee kind of bouncing off each other but this is what it looks like in the inside it's soft to the touch um but they kind of like packed it in here um it smells so good i wish you guys could smell this but definitely check it out this is by um scrub and co that's what the label looks like i'll see if i can find um a link for you guys um on amazon or something for this so it's definitely a tj mix um oh so this is the next piece um that i got i'm really excited about this i like it a lot um i think that it kind of alludes to um some of the um what can i say i say um a lot but i feel like it alludes to um, part of the journey that I'm trying to like go on with just like myself and um, trying out new things um, So this is it I'm so excited She's so cute and then she's thick and she got big boobs And so I was like this reminds me of me and then she got a bun in her hair I like to wear my natural hair in a bun. Um, I love buns and girl look at her booty <laughs> But yeah, so it's just like a sculpted piece. It looks like it's made of wood and like somebody like curved it out. I mean, carved it out and stuff like that. Um, but I love this so much and I like the position that she's in. I just feel like it's very feminine. Um, and I'm debating on whether or not I want this to be in my room or if I was going to put it in the I think I'm going to leave this in my room. Um, but I love this so much. I think it's so pretty. Like, look at this. I just don't know where I want to put it's the butt. It's the booty for me. It's the booty for me. I don't know where I'm gonna put her. I love how she's thick. I love that her thighs and her calves is thick. Um, it's so, so pretty. Um, so, yeah, I'm very happy about this. Um, so the next thing I got, um, I told you guys I was gonna get like a uh, towel and rags. I need to get some new ones. Um, and then I got this rug. So, as you guys can see, like I said, it's kind of a unintentional theme. 
um you can see the cranberry lines throughout the rug um but this is what it looks like white on one side and then this is the other side okay i'm gonna put this out once i um kind of redo a few things in my room i'll show you guys what everything looks like i know you can see like my wall and my little um closet like area over here my sunflowers and stuff um but yes yeah, so i'm gonna add this i wanted to just have something um to step on to i have carpet my floor is carpet in my bedroom um but i wanted to have something that was like nice to kind of just step onto once i get out of bed um and kind of just like give me good vibes good energy when i wake up in the morning time um so that's why i got this i think it's really pretty i love all of the colors that's in it um there's a nice size too um this here. What else did I get? Oh, and then I found they have they sell clothes and stuff at TJ Maxx too. So I got like this little one piece um jumper. I feel like this would be good for like just an everyday everyday look, everyday vibes, cinches at the waist, um, no sleeves, just something something simple. Um, and then the I like how the ankles are um I don't whoop I gotta actually look this up. Like what would this kind of um what would that be called um but yeah i got that um this was only 15 dollars, so that's really good because this is a whole this is an outfit um and you can dress it up or dress it down so um lastly i went to target and i got like my basic essentials does um i like the body wash one i feel like it's a little easy to use in the shower cucumber one is my favorite one that they have i love the original um smell too so i go back and forth between those two so i also got these i, I don't know if that's called if that's pronounced real but um they're organic cotton cover pads um and they're it says they're chlorine free fragrance free um and i got the size a large which is for like a I guess like a, a more a little bit of a heavier flow um and yeah so i'm gonna try these out it says that they're 100 organic cotton um super absorbent core maximum airflow leak lock locker technology um this is what they look like i'm gonna open them up when i use them eventually but this is what it looks like that looks pretty comfortable so i um yeah, I really want to try this out. I always see their tampons, but I didn't know they actually have pads, too. So, I'm going to try this out. I'll do a review on this and let you guys know how that is. Um, and I just got, like, my regular basics I always have. I was telling you guys, like, how I like the Santex, um Radiant. Um, I got me some more face wash, Cetaphil. Um, I got a bigger one this time. And then I just got my toothpaste, whitening with baking powder, and, um, baking soda and then i got this um my i, I got another um, another one of my concealers i'm gonna make sure this is actually the right color though yeah because i don't think it is this one is called deep chestnut and then this one i got is deep olive mm. this one has a red undertone and i naturally have a red undertone so that's why I went with this one. Um, but this one is kind of, I guess it would have an olive on it. I'm assuming that's the goal of it. Um, but we'll see. I'll, I'll see how I like this one. I really like this one a lot because it it gives me that contour, but it's not like too light. And it kind of, it's, it's kind of yellow too. It's kind of, it, I can see the red. Like once, you know, it starts to separate. So I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's like a little red um so it's definitely a red color in here but i feel like it looks a little yellow underneath which i like um but yeah so i'm gonna try this one now and i think that that's everything i got so um yeah i don't have anything else planned for the night um i'm going to do my laundry and then so i can get ready for uh work tomorrow and then um that's pretty much it so i'm gonna end the vlog out here um i don't think i'm gonna continue this one into tomorrow i think that i'm gonna try it out and see what i prefer more and what you guys prefer more if you guys like for me to do a weekly vlog um which i'll probably if i do a weekly vlog i think what i'm gonna try to do is have them posted every sunday um 
and try to keep them in a range of like an hour, um, like that type of time range. Um, and then if not, then I'll try to do like maybe uploading a vlog like two to three times a week. But I want to, I want to be, um, honest and I want to be like a woman of my word and I want to do what's going to fit well with me and what's going to be pleasing to you guys as well as my subscribers so um yeah I'm going to close this out thank you guys so much for tuning in make sure you like comment and subscribe follow me on Instagram um at DD the hairstylist and my business page DD hair experience um and just so you guys can keep up with me I post a whole lot on my story um I actually am going to be getting into taking more pictures and stuff this year um but yeah so make sure you guys follow me make sure you comment below if you have any questions if, any suggestions or anything like that i'm open to um all types of criticism so um yeah i hope you guys enjoy make sure you like 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 and subscribe hit the subscribe button okay and share um but yeah love you guys see you guys in the next video bye